Dream's former PvP trainer just got exposed. Let's get right into it. So this person goes under the name of Sponker. They have over 40,000 subscribers and they were getting really good support. Basically, they got exposed for talking to a 14-year-old girl and admitting it and then also being racist. This is just ridiculous. Fumbled the career of a lifetime. I do want to give a shout out to Blissolic and Nine Takes because their videos inspired me to make this. So go subscribe to them and check them out. But yeah, basically join the Lifesteal SMP. As you can see, they were getting really good support. Paradox 2 is in it. There's a lot of popular people in it and it's just a great SMP. Well, they got kicked out a few days later because of this clip right here yo that's crazy and it's them saying the hard r just randomly saying it right here so go ahead roll it that's that's <laughs> that's six by ten that's six by ten fucking nigga Whoa. And yeah, that's disappointing as usual. But there were already people calling them out for more things deeper than just that. Basically, this person, he goes by the name of Spencer as well, was messaging a 14-year-old girl. And look at these messages. I sound stupid. I miss you. Come back to me. What you mean you sound stupid? Like, yeah, I don't know how else to explain it. Sounding stupid to me is like really hot. Like, what? That sucks because you're not going to be muted. How do you know? I might mute. Like, it's just it's just so weird. Like, the cringe is just beyond. Then says, good girl. So you're not muting tonight. Thank you, princess. Like, what the hell? And then says, it does not take a lot of time to make you horny baby like that i literally feel so uncomfortable like saying that out loud like i just can't anyways the popular youtuber sharpness calls him out and goes i don't have words right now but i also do i think you should just leave the internet delete all of your shit go work on your life because your brain is rotted and effed it's true and most definitely i mean like if you're saying that to a 14 year old girl and you're an adult like you have some issues well let me say that one more time an adult saying this to a kid that they've never met online like you are down bad horrendous dog bonker goes because what is there to talk about sharpness goes going to argue with me i don't want over this you too bro what i'm not going to give an excuse there is nothing to talk about xd ain't no way you saying xd to reply to this but then slowly starts thinking about oh shoot like this is a serious allegation maybe i should take this serious and says i was willing to throw out the friendship just because i saw how you treated a woman and i didn't want to surround myself with that so i was willing to throw out that friendship so he's talking about the person named Vinny that was in the messages i guess that was Vinny's ex the 14 year old girl that he was talking to and said that he saw him treat her like shit so basically he wanted to have a relationship with her which is insane to me then says, I've been on the fence about it because I know it's wrong, so don't sit here and act like I had no hesitation. But then finally admits this and says, this group chat is a few of the people I love the most. I need to tell you guys that I did go behind Vinny's back and flirt with his ex. Not to mention that she was really young, 14. I love the attention she gave me and it was seriously effed of me to do. I seriously regret it in hindsight and I cannot stress it enough. I know it isn't who I am. I want to change. Sharpness raged at me for what had happened and threatened me if I didn't leave the internet to go work on myself. You might think that he's wrong for threatening me and even raging at me, but he's a real man. I love him. He's always been so real for me. Even though he just unadded me after all that, I just want him to know the best for me. I know he wants me to improve, so that's what I will do. I'm going to be no longer talking to Izzy, and I'm leaving the internet for a while. I've been weak mentally. I try to cover it up by bodybuilding, but at the end of the day, the only way to fix my weak mental is to actually work on myself and fix myself. I'm sorry to you, Vinny, Sharpness, and you guys. And hopefully you're sorry to the victim, too. And yeah, after reading that, I am beyond disappointed in Sponker. I mean, you had over 40,000 subscribers, and you just fumbled your whole career over what? Finally took somewhat accountability, and I'm glad that you're gonna, you know, work on fixing and bettering yourself but oh my hell like the internet can be a dark place sometimes y'all yeah that is the uh story of what happened you know like a nice little fast summary of it and it's just disappointing to see people blowing great career where they can make millions of dollars where they can change lives around them talk to a 14 year old girl like y'all i keep telling people this if you are lonely go find someone that's your age and go talk to them just go talk to them just reach out and be like hey what's up do you want to be friend like something man like don't do this i'm so tired of this always happening in the minecraft community it's ridiculous go watch nine takes video if you want to see like more of the screenshot it's, i didn't include everything because you know sponker pretty much admitted everything so it's like you don't need all the proof in the world to just prove the point of what they did was wrong but yeah this pretty much made my screen crawl let me know how you guys feel about this down below in the comments and remember do not send dream any hate if someone sends dream hate and they're like oh my gosh dream was associated with this guy it's like dream did not know don't send him any hate but yeah that's gonna be it let me know your thoughts down below if you enjoyed hit the like button subscribe if you're new and like we always say empire out